I am disappointed in myself. Okay, so I had the footage recorded. My audio was great, but then my dumbass was like, "Oh, hey, that circle button makes the thing cancel," and I was like, "Ooh, that might end the recording." It did, but it also scrapped all the audio, which is BS. But time to try to repeat everything I said. Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode on this BS of a channel. My name is not Coconut Snake, my name is I'm Still Trapped in the Basement, please send help, I've been captured once again. And right here I have some beautiful footage of me playing Ark Survival Evolved. It's like a dinosaur game, I've loved dinosaurs ever since I was younger, so don't fucking call me a weeb. I'll fucking break into your house, twist your neck off, sacrifice you to the Dark Lords, and then with the remains of your body, throw them into a dump where they'll never find your remains because they've been burned to ash. Uh, I, yeah, that, that voice crack bullshit thing came out wrong. The point is I'll kill you. Anyways. So, today I'm going to be talking about Paul Zimmer, or Troy Becker. Yes, this guy has two identities, which, in my alteration of the whole thing, if I use that correctly, it just really doesn't make a whole lot of sense on why he has two identities. I don't really see why you would need them. I mean, unless you're getting, like, hunted down by hitmen, which, I mean, mm then you must have some value on you. You might give you might give me your location. Anyways, anyways, I can continue on. Uh, anyways, yeah, don't judge me. Uh, uh, fuck you. Anyways, so it's like one of his identities is like um, what's it again? One of his identities is like 19 years old, which is the one he uses online for most of the time. Other identity says that he's 24 years old. Come on. If you stoop to a point in life where you're gonna lie about being t 19 years old when you're actually 24, come on now. Come on. But I can get a little bit of a grasp on both identities. Well, I mean. I can understand one of them, the other one I'm gonna scream at for a little bit. So I can understand if you're like 19 years old and you want to seem older so that, so that like, oh, I'm getting protected by this. Um, so like, oh, so people won't feel like messing with me as an adult, but they'll just see me as irresponsible otherwise. Yes, I can understand that, but like, Time to move on to his other identity, which may be the truer one, because everyone wants to be younger. Which is understandable, unless you were unless you had acne in middle school. <laughs> me, shoot me. So, um, like, if you're 24 and lying about being 19, two kids, which typically range from 19, no, not 19, from like 12 to 14 year olds. Which, I, you know, I might as well say that he probably lies about his identity, even him, like, not being 19. Which is, like, still a load of gobshite. Doesn't change anything. But, I mean, if you're gonna lie about being 19 when you're actually 24, congratulations, you won the pedophile award. You did great. But, come on. If you've gone that low to a point in life where you're lying about this shit, congratulations. You're what we call the bad guy. Time to call the police. Yes. It's like, you call the police. Uh, hey, oh, hey, look, for 20 seconds, pass that. Uh, ring, ring, uh, um, yes, hello, ma'am, what's your emergency? This is a pedophile on a kidnap who's lying about his age. Well, there's nothing we can really do about that. He hasn't committed an offense. He's lying to my child! And I don't know where I'd be going with that skin. That, that honestly wasn't that good, but anyway, uh, continuing. So it's... My whole thing that makes me concerned about this whole situation is why he lies about his age. Come on, like, what's the point in lying to your age to kids? 
Well, I can actually understand one of them. <laughs> okay. Time to go on my little reasoning. So, I think he's so one thing I might understand is for his little older fans. The ones that think that he's, like, 19. So 19 year olds, like, may be in college. I'm not sure if he's in college, but if he is, then this might be a good theory. But if he's lying about his age and he's in college, then his older fans would be like, then he might have said, oh, like, oh, hey, I did, oh, hey, I'm going to college. Can you guys help me pay off my, um, pay off my loans? Which, to be fair, is quite the smart, uh, is quite the smart marketing trip. If I use a tip, tip, I might have a trip, a tactic, I don't know, fuck you. But, my whole little glance at the situation, if, if you're gonna lie about kids to cut your students at off, one bravo, very, very good tactic, uh, some of us are very gullible. But, Come on, if you if you really have to stoop that low, then you kind of deserve to get made fun of by people like me. Wait, it's white. How did? I was about I was about to say Adatos like it was his name. It was Adatos. his Twitter. Um, like, yeah, some of us are very dumb, so we probably would fall your fall for your little antics. Which, to be fair, is indeed quite smart. However, it's still corrupt, so it trained upon a society, yada yada yada, all of that stuff. Now, I'm not a bad person, I'm only villainous when I have to be. But when I am, I can be. I can go through with the whole thing quite well. Like, bitch, the moment you leave the house, I'ma steal shit from your wallet, and then I'm gonna, I, I don't know, like, do it little by little for the next week, and be like, hey, I got this money from dad, before we get in the backyard. Good job, son. Yes, believe me, you bitch. I, I, I haven't done that yet, but maybe when I stoop, maybe when I stoop, what was this fucker that I will? No. This guy says that he's 19, <laughs> but look, chances are he's probably 24, because, well, why wouldn't you want to lie about being younger? Which basically means that this 24-year-old is lying to kids and twerking on an app for them. Yes, this guy twerks. He is an F-boy. Which basically makes him a 24-year-old male working for these kids that they most likely don't even know his actual age. I would assume that that's the case. Seeing as he has two identities. Both under different names. He doesn't mention one of his names. Sorry for the yawn thing. If he doesn't even mention one of his names, then I would assume no one would find it out. But... Unless they have his facial features, then well, long live the fucker then. But enough about that. Moving on. So this guy not only does that, but with the financial thing, I probably forgot to mention that he says like, oh, if you guys put in this little emote. Like, it's like live action stickers, because the app he uses to get the money out of the kids, obviously, has to be some way of actually getting a fairly decent amount of money. Um, I'm pretty sure that you can turn in the stickers for money, if they're posted to your damn stream on that fucking group off of Instagram Live. However, these things cost money. You pay money, it's for the live action stickers, which can be turned in by the person that's, do that's streaming for more money. It's a vicious fucking cycle. Which, by the way, if you're gonna pull off that shit, 
then, well, congratulations. You're one of the low lowlifes. But he turns it into a little game, so he even makes it seem like it's more innocent than it actually is. It's like, hey, daddy, I spent more money that isn't mine on this guy. I spent $100,000 approximately. But, anyways, time to draw the line in the sand. Because now it looks like we've passed the 10 minute mark. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Um, and as always, I'll see you all in a good night and pray that I don't accidentally hit the circle button this time.